We've all by now most likely seen the footage of Matt Rowell eating grass before his game, but he isn't the only one who has a very odd and unique pre-game ritual. I think the weirdest part of this whole scenario is that Matt Rowell is in his fourth year of AFL footy and has played 47 games. How are we only just finding out about this now? Let's take a listen to what Channel 9's footy classified has to say about the situation and get some insight from Cornsey and Matty Lloyd. He does this at every single game, at every single ground across Australia. So we think he's probably eaten grass at about 18 yeah. venues now. Or not, no, not joking. That's his pre-game routine. He eats grass. Very which, strange. Well, I'm surprised he hasn't got sick from it. Just, it. just for the record, did you have something weird or normal, you, well, that were normal regularly you did every week? I wore the same bathers and I didn't wash them. But I don't think that's that weird, is yeah, it? What about you? Uh, I, I was, um, yeah, same pasta before every night. I wore the same jocks like Kano. Did you uh, wash Didn't your touch the banner until I was captain. But Rao isn't the only one with a bizarre pre-game ritual. Listen to Channel 7's interview of Adam Trelaw back in 2016 and see what he does before every game he plays. Uh, I've got quite a fair bit. So game day, I do three things and I've done it all 80 games I've played. I, um, I wear red jocks. So... Each year, there's one pair of red jocks per year. So this year, I've got my new pair, and I wear them every game. Um, I watch The Simpsons. I have to watch The Simpsons on my laptop while I'm in the shower shaving my legs. So they're my superstitions. How the heck does he get out there? <laughs> that, that, is, that is the most bizarre superstition I've ever heard. And what about when he goes interstate and oh, yeah. there's not a bath? And sits in and shaves his leg. Yeah. I'm not sure I'd be admitting that one. <laughs> And I guess this one's not as weird as the last two, but let's have a listen to what ex-Crow player Tom Lynch used to do before every home game. My pre-game's uh, pretty simple. Um, a lot of guys have some superstitions, but um, I maybe have a couple. Um, always have to have crunch chocolate the night before a game, which is a little bit unique. We always get the same risotto. A good friend of ours, my mate of mine, Aggie, makes my risotto for me. And then always go to the same place uh, for breakfast, go to Coffee Philosophy for breakfast on a on a morning of a game and, and have my poached eggs, so. And then this is what he had to do at every away game. When I've got a bit of time on my hands, I like to uh, search the ground and, and find an AFL record. And if I can find that, I'll uh, spend my time, depending how however long it takes, uh, trying to do the spot the difference at the back, so. Most of these pre-game rituals happen because a player does this before the game and that has a great game. So they carry on this tradition like a ritual to try and ensure that they perform the same as they did in their potential breakout game. So which pre-game ritual do you think was the weirdest? For me, Adam Trelaw takes the cake. Are there any pre-game rituals that you've heard of that I've missed? Leave them in the comments below. Thanks for watching.